In this section, we are going to talk about how to divide a line segment in a given ratio. So if you have a line segment PQ and you have a point M that divides this line segment in a given ratio, for example here, let's say the given ratio is A to B, then how do you find the coordinates of this new point M? Okay, that's the question. So A is to B. So you're dividing this line segment into A is to B parts. How do you find the X coordinate? How do you find the Y coordinate of this point M? So the formula is very simple. The coordinates of M, M will have a X and a Y, right? This is a comma right in the middle. So this is going to be your X coordinate and this side is going to be your Y coordinate. So to get the uh, X, this is how you do it. You multiply A, which is this number, the first part of the ratio, A x2 plus b x1. Since this is the x coordinate, you'll only have x coordinates in the first part divided by the total of the ratio a plus b. And the y is given by the same ratio. The only change is instead of x, you're going to put y there. So a y2 plus b y1. We are only picking y here because this is a y coordinate divided by a plus b. So if you know the ratio, that means A and B, and if you know the points X1, Y1, and X2, Y2, this problem is a simple matter of substitution, and you get your answer. So let's do an example. This is an, um, sorry, not this one. This is an example that I, a question that I got from the park practice tests that are available online. So let's try to do this problem. In the coordinate plane shown, Point C lies on the segment AB, line segment AB. So C lies somewhere here in between these two points A and B. If the ratio of the set of the length of AC to the length of CB is 3 is to 1. This ratio here is 3 is to 1. So that's our A and this is our B. Label your ratio as A and B. So we know that this line segment is going to be divided to a total of four parts. Okay, where did I get the 4 from? 3 plus 1. So what they're saying is the line segment AB is going to be cut into 4 parts, 4 equal parts. Like that, right? 1, 2, 3, 4 parts. And the ratio of the line segment of AC to CB is 3 is to 1. So after 3 parts, which point divides it in the ratio as 3 is to 1? Okay, 1, 2, 3, and this point has three parts here and one part over there. So they're asking you for the coordinates of this point. That's what it really means. So let's just apply the formula really quick. Um, the formula is this. The new point here is C. So C is given to B. Let's write the formula first. It's um, AX2 and bx1, you get the x-coordinate by multiplying and adding the x-coordinates only over a plus b, comma, ay2, ey1 over a plus b. Let's plug in the values. So a, label the first point as x1, y1, your x1 and y1 is 2 and 4. Label the second point as x2, y2, your x2 and y2 is 10 and 10. So AX2 will be 3 times 10, sorry, that's a Y coordinate, 3 times 10, which is X2. 3 times 10 is 30, plus BX1 will be, um, <coughs> B is 1 and X1 is 2, B is 1 and X1 is 2, so 1 times 2 is over A plus B, A and B are 3 and 1, so 3 plus 1, the total is 4. Let me write this, A was 3, X2 was 10, that's how we got this one. So, um, let me pick another color so you can see it clearly. A is 3, Y2 is 10, so 3 times 10, the first number becomes 30. B is 1 and Y2, sorry, Y1 is 4, so 1 times 4 is 4 divided by the total a plus b will be 4. So this final answer comes to be 
30 plus 2 is 32, you know, and 32 divided by 4 is 8. 30 plus 4 is 34, and 34 divided by 4, uh, put it as a decimal, you get 8.5. So those are the coordinates of the new point, which actually divides this line segment into the given ratio.